Hi, and welcome back. In today's episode, I'm gonna talk about directing. Well, I'm not gonna talk about directing. I brought my wife Jill along, and she's got three tips for first-time directors. Tip one. My first tip is really all about crews. It's kind of a two-in-one. Um, I would say always try and hire people that have more experience than you. Um, you should really try to always be the novice person on your own set. And um, also just try and keep your crews capped. Uh, I see a lot of first-time filmmakers having huge crews, huge productions, and as much as everyone is well-intentioned and it's a, it's a lot of fun, it can really slow things down and add a little sense of chaos to things that are trying to run smoothly. Tip two. So table reads are really useful for writers, um, but I find that rehearsals are more useful for directors, and it really gives you and your actors a chance to sit down, go through scene by scene, and figure out what the objectives and the goals are for each of your characters. Make sure you're on the same page for what their motivations are for getting there, and just kind of lay your roadmap. And then um, when you get to production and you're actually filming it, um, you've got that kind of peace of mind that you have the same thoughts as your actor and everything kind of comes together a little bit more cleanly. Tip three. Usually on film sets, the director will find that they don't have as much time as they thought they would or that as they hoped they would. So when you're really breaking down your script ahead of shooting and putting all that time into pre-production, really make sure you have more than enough time to get everything you need. You're never going to get in trouble for being ahead of schedule, um, but it really will make a difference to you to not feel like every minute of the day you're rushing through the most important part of the process. And that's it. Thanks for joining me and I'll see you on the next one.